Hey there, Andy Lewis here from Working From Anywhere. I'm here in Queenstown, checking out all the, the amazing activities and things we can do for our next Working From Anywhere retreat. And today I'm here with Brad Patterson from Totally Tourism. Brad's a man that actually is responsible for, all for me having that amazing helicopter experience yesterday. Got to uh, fly up onto one of the peaks and hang out up there, it was amazing. And uh, we're gonna have a bit of a chat to Brad, find out a bit about his company, about Brad and what he does. So Brad, a bit about yourself. A bit about myself. Um, so I'm the sales manager for the Totally Tourism Group. And so part of what I do is I'm responsible for revenue that is, is coming into the company. And in particular, Totally Tourism Group owns the helicopter line here. Um, we've got 21 helicopters. And yeah. basically what it's about is taking people out into the backcountry and showing them you know, the, the, the unique parts of New Zealand. And uh, I know you love what you do. Because, <laughs> uh, we go back a bit of a way and you know, back in time I brought a few conference groups here and you've been doing this for years, it's a family company. Why do you love what you do? What, okay. what do you, what's the love about it, why? Well I mean, you know, it's, it's, it's not bad showing helicopter rides. <laughs> it's it's not, like, uh, look, the, the key thing for me is that I think what we offer is taking people away out of the norm by helicopter showcasing you know the unique parts of New Zealand and you know I've been doing this for 19 years and you know you still get a kick when you see people get off the helicopter yeah. with a grin from ear to ear because yeah. right. helicopters are not it's not something that everybody just suddenly does it's a bucket list item and being yeah. able to take people out show them that amazing area and leave an imprint on them is, is pretty pretty cool fantastic yeah so We've got a group of uh, successful business owners coming here. They're at the end of a, a working from anywhere program. What can they expect uh, when they come to Queenstown? Well, look, Queenstown, Queenstown itself is pretty much, we, we self style ourselves as the dawn of New Zealand's tourism crown. Yeah. And when I talk to people about Queenstown, I say, look, it's pretty much like Disneyland for adults. If you want to go hiking and walking, you can go hiking and walking. If you want to have food and wine, you can have food and wine. If you want to jump in a helicopter and zip up to the top of a mountain, you can do that. If you want to go jet boating, whitewater rafting, etc. So it's really about coming here and testing yourself and showcasing different activities for people when they're here. And you can do pretty much everything in Queenstown. Awesome. Yeah, it is. It's known as the uh, adrenaline capital of, world, uh, yep. of the world. I believe there's so much to do here. So moving away from uh, things to do, uh, as far as uh, your business. These guys are coming from, you know, are working from anywhere program. I know you work from anywhere because you spend a lot of times overseas. You've just told me you've spent 150 days overseas, so you have to work from anywhere. But also I know you do because we were actually going to have this interview yesterday, but you chose to work, work from, from home. home. So what impact has been, has been, benefit and impact has been able to work from anywhere had on your life? Well. Getting the work-life balance is pretty important. Yeah. Um, as you rightly said, I was 150 days overseas last year and got two young kids, so it's about having the ability to pop in and out of, of, of working for the company when and where I can. Yeah. So what I've sort of implemented there is you've got to have good systems and good structures around what you do. And for me, it's about making sure that I can be accessible from anywhere. So whether I'm in, I've just come back from Southeast Asia, um, I'm off to America next yeah. month, um, or at the end of this month, um, and it's being able to actually to trust the people you work with, yeah. but also being able to be with good systems, like obviously yeah. email, getting access to the different files, etc. Yeah. And once you've got that done and implemented, you can do that. Yeah, and it is absolutely essential, and um, that's exactly what uh, the program is about. To uh, So I know uh, Queenstown, well it's been a few years since I've been to Queenstown, and it was pretty busy last time I here, now it's enormously busy, uh, and a lot of that Growth is probably, I'm sure it's come from tourism, tourism, but are you also seeing other uh, business owners uh, leaving uh, the, either the cities or coming internationally to come in here to also operate their business from here and enjoy everything that Queenstown's got to offer as well as the tourism? Are you seeing any of that? Yeah, there's a bit of, bit of both really. I mean, um, there's no denying the fact that the, the unfortunate events of the Christchurch earthquake, there was, yeah. there was an influx of businesses that came down to Queenstown to set up. Yeah. And part of that obviously is the fact that we had a lot of direct airlines from Australia into Queenstown with the International Airport here. Um, lifestyle wise, you know, people are looking to try and get away from the hustle and bustle. And, yeah. and look, Queenstown has its growing pains at the moment. You know, it's yeah. gone from a small sleepy town and it's getting bigger and bigger. Um, so definitely in that respect, 
yes, there has been a growth in, in tourism numbers, like obviously big growth, sort of 10 to 15 percent over the last couple of years in tourism numbers arriving to New Zealand. We get just around about two million visitors to Queenstown a year, um, but there is no doubt that there's been big growth and big business owners coming here and setting up, and you can see that with the development that's been happening out here, in, in particular at the Five Mile and, and um, in Queenstown Central. Yeah, okay. So, last questions. <laughs> three questions, or the the three last question of three questions. Yeah, here no, we go. <laughs> last three questions. Okay. Uh, top three things that uh, people must do when they come to Queenstown. Well, look, big one for me, obviously, selling helicopters. Absolutely. Got a helicopter. well, I, I can got, say got, yes got, to got that. Got to push my own in that department. Yeah. Look, the big one here is, um, there's no doubt in fact, Queenstown's getting very well known for food and wine, so you want to come here, you want to get out, go try some of the Pinot Noirs that we've got here. Yeah. Um, also, very much outdoorsy as well. Look, there's a lot of hiking, walking, there's a big cycling um, run through now, which I'm sure would be right up your alley, you've yeah. been with your cycling. Um, so it's really about coming here and experiencing that. I mean, you've got to go up the Gondo as well when you're yeah, in Queenstown. Yeah, Anyone that Google's coming to Queenstown, they'll see that iconic photo from up on the top there. So that's sort of must-do stuff. Um, but as I said before, it's very much about Disneyland for adults. Yeah, no yeah. matter what you're into, um, if people want to go bungee jumping and jump out of a plane, whatever, you can do it. But if you just want to come and relax and walk around and enjoy the ambience of food and wine, you can do that too. Fantastic. And we, of course, will be doing many of those things, and there's plenty of those options here. Uh, thank you so much, for, Brad, for sharing, no. and also thank you much, so much for that awesome uh, helicopter experience yesterday. It was absolutely amazing. So, if you're not already booked in, if you want to spend more time living life outside of your business, if your business is not giving you the lifestyle freedom that you really deserve, get on this program. Uh, let's transition your business to work from anywhere. Give you some more time with your friends and your family, as well as coming over here to experience Queenstown, which will be absolutely amazing. This has been Andy Willis from uh, Working From Anywhere, empowering successful business owners to spend more time living life outside of their business. If you're interested, comment below, send me a message, book in a 15 minute call and let's chat.